It's early July in San Simeon, California. For the northern elephant seals, the mating and birthing season are already complete. In June, subadult and adult males are making their second annual migrations between San Simeon and Guadalupe Island in Mexico. Few females remain on the beach, which gives males a chance to practice their intimidation skills before the mating season begins in November. In a few weeks, the majority of them will head back to Guadalupe Island. When they return here in November and begin the fight for dominance, the battles become much more aggressive, bloody, and sometimes deadly. The winning alpha males will have up to 40 females for their part of the beach. Since the focus of this migration is for the males to complete molting, the intimidation tactics are strong but not overly aggressive. Pink battle scars remain for some of the older males, which can weigh up to 5,000 pounds at the beginning of the mating season. Today, their population is considered stable, but back in the 1860s, when it was discovered that their fat could be used to burn in lamp oil, their population was decimated and even considered extinct. Jump ahead to 1922, and the Mexican government has been observing a small group of less than 1,000 on Guadalupe Island and granted them protection. 43 years later, in San Francisco, California, the first pup was born. Their recovered population is one of the greatest success stories for endangered species coming back from the brink. But the success isn't without its consequences. Because of such a small gene pool that rebuilt the species, they're more susceptible to disease. And pollution and habitat loss are additional threats they face today. If you're passing through San Simeon, California on the Pacific Coast Highway, you need to stop and check out these extraordinary mammals who are usually there year round, but see the fewest in August. I hope you've enjoyed the video and please consider subscribing and thanks for watching.